Yeah, we are going to look at uh, hacking Active Directory using the zero local vulnerability, which have been around uh, since around 2020, but it's still uh, very, very dangerous. So I'm going to download the proof of concept script from this uh, GitHub repository. So I'll clone it to my local machine. So once it clones, it will, uh, I'll uh, just change directory to zero logon. And then uh, these are the files that we are going to use. So let me use nmap so that I enumerate my NetBIOS name because it's going to be used or uh, required by this script. So just give it a second there to enumerate. Right, so we can see that it's an active directory. It has uh, the NetBIOS name and the NetBIOS name that uh, we require is this. So I'll just copy this to my clipboard and then uh, the script that I'll require for this is set underscore empty underscore pw dot py. So Python 3, the name of this script, set empty pw underscore py, paste the NetBIOS name, and then the IP address of your domain controller. So once you do that, it will tell you uh, that it has succeeded. So this is a command that you need. So going back to that uh, repository, the next thing that we need to do is uh, dump the hashes for the Active Directory admin. So the script, the next script that you will need for that is highlighted. So I'll just paste it in my machine. And then uh, for the domain, I'll use uh, what I eliminated with nmap. So I'll just remove this and put my domain name and then uh, my domain that and then uh, for the NetBIOS name I'll just copy this. Remember uh, this we got from nmap uh, script. So I'll paste my NetBIOS name and then of course I will need my IP address. So once I hit enter, I'm going to get the the hash for the domain admin. And then I'm going to use that hash to log into my domain controller and uh, effectively take control of that machine. All right, so it tells you dumping domain credentials, uh, Kerberos keys have been grabbed, and then it gives you a list there of the users that are available in that server. So we have a uh, the administrator and then if you look down here we also have another user called Vere but we are not going to uh, log in with that user since we already have the admin so just use the WMI exec to log in with the hash from the previous screen so I've logged in and to confirm I'll just uh, type who am I so that I'm sure that I am uh, the domain admin so there we go, and we have uh, taken that machine.